Let's move on to the use of AI to augment and optimize operations within your organization. Every organization goes on a progressive journey. They don't just immediately jump into unsupervised machine learning and advanced autonomy. They start with automation, which tends to be rules driven, and then move on to AI augmentation. With AI augmentation, you're performing information gathering to establish context intelligence understanding and start to begin making decisions and providing suggestions. This really upskills your team members, but consider it a human in the loop. It's constantly verifying inputs and outputs and optimizing workflow. And then we move on to autonomy. And this is where AI can continuously learn and get con like intricate contextual understanding of the data in your environment and start to pr provide complex decision making skills and moving on to autonomous action. Here the human is out of the loop, but still heavily involved in the process, specifically with input and data integrity, as well as testing, verification, validation, and most importantly, control in post processing and workflow optimization ensuring that the AI would do the same thing that a human would do in that case. Here at Dark Trace, we've gone on the same journey. We've been implementing AI for security for the last 10 years with a security mindset at the beginning. So we want, we're, we're, we want to help you think through securing the use of your AI, what may it be internal use or external, by providing visibility and coverage across your entire digital estate. We want you to understand how all the assets work with AI. May they be in cloud, SaaS, email, OT, IT, or endpoint. And just ensuring that you are able to enforce security policies, apply those good cybersecurity principles across the use of AI. May it be internal or external. Because remember, if you're not choosing to adopt AI internally, your employees may do this on your behalf through the use of third-party generative AI tools. This past year, we have deployed detect and respond models that would give you that visibility into how employees are using third-party generative AI tools and allow you to autonomously respond and enforce your organization's security posture for those tools. It could be just to extend the visibility to see how they're using it and who's using it. It could be to allow a subset of trained users who understand generative AI use cases. It could be to allow the use of generative AI, but block the upload of data to mitigate IP or data loss, or you could just wholesale block the use of third-party tools altogether, depending on your security posture, giving you visibility and a way to enforce.